Uh, you know what? Let's let's at least give that a shot. <laughs> Great, <laughs> perfect shot. I did it. Nine eight zero four one seven nine one. Oh yeah, that's right. I remember being frustrated, but why did I decide to go play Oxid? <laughs> what 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 uh, happened to my brain here? <laughs> why did I decide this was a good idea? So right now that does nothing, but now I can actually get down there and reset it. Down there, up there, whatever. Okay, did not quite realize that was gonna put me in such a pickle, but luckily my positioning was absolutely flawless. Okay, so I, I heard the explosion sound. The explosion sound is what I want, so hopefully we're good. Now, assuming that I did everything else absolutely correctly, which definitely is what happened. Yes! Yes! <laughs> oh my god, sweet progress. Don't even care if I'm hitting those. They no longer matter. Don't go zipping off the edge like an idiot. Do it like a gentleman, says Specklad. Yeah, exactly. Oh no, it's some kind of weird gravity well. Where is the other oxid even? I don't see the other oxid! Is the edge of this screen death? No, it's probably the other oxids. Uh, plural. Okay, this gravity well isn't too bad. The uh, number of explosions happening is not a good indication of how fun this is. I hope there are only the four. I don't want to have to twiddle about doing this nonsense for a long time. Okay, so that's hopefully this one. Yes. Oh my god, stop it with the explosions! That's a circle. Come on, be it, be it, be it, be done, be done, be done, be done, be done. If I can manage to hit it. No! <laughs> oh, there are more oxen somewhere! Okay, what's at the bottom of this screen? Oh, nothing. It's actually protected. That's shocking. That's that's way too polite. But then where the hell are the remaining oxids? Is it just like some random blocks are actually oxids or something? That would be very annoying. That would be annoying in a way that this game certainly has been annoying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See those, see those twiddly blocks to the left? Those mean something. There's no way those are there just for, like, fashion. Those, those do something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that sound, that, that sound means something. That's, that is not an incidental bit of music. <laughs> Oh, they're over there, I see. And indeed, there was a... another sort of teleporter that I couldn't get to. I'm betting there's at least two. Okay, I see. I understand. <laughs> I understand now. <laughs> I need to get all the way through to the left, and my hint is that. Okay, okay, that's a breakable block. Frickin' game not having any damned rules. The rule is that every block has 12 different behaviors, but as long as you memorize all 12 of them, then you're still screwed. <laughs> These are done. I don't I don't need to worry about those anymore. Okay, so that oh my of course, of course, it is as close to the edge as it can be. What I wanted was this weird gravity and really precise controls. Thank you. And bouncing blocks. All of those at the same time, please. I didn't hit it. I can't even tell if I'm right yet. This is Satan's work. I don't know if I hit it or not. I didn't see a, a blink against it, so maybe I just didn't hit it? This isn't the most annoying sound ever. Oh my god. Heart attack. I hate this. So that leads me here, of all places. 
Does this just go back again? Yeah. Like, do I want to be here? Is here good? What's the point of being here? Guess I'm about to find out. I'm not about to find out, because this is nothing. How can this be nothing? Um, pardon? Then where's the one associated with that? What? Are these something? What? I mean, even if one of these is a destructible block, it doesn't lead anywhere that I haven't already gone. Is this area just pointless? I mean, this, this game is not beyond red herrings. Maybe you just need to go through here a bunch of times like in that one level, says so Speclad. I don't know, it doesn't quite feel like it's leading to that. Maybe there is, maybe that's a hint that on the opposite end there's the same? I don't really want to try that with the opposite end, it's so dangerous. But I truly, god, the gravity well sucks. I truly can't think of anything. Hello? Oh. No, no, goodbye, never mind. Oh. That's not destructible. That's a bit of a surprise. What? What? What is this? What is the significance of that? Why are those blocks in They've gotta mean something, game, please. I hate it. I hate it. I hate that I just won. That, that, that victory brings me no joy, only suffering. <laughs> the whole, like, there was, oh, the red herring area that was so difficult to get to. Why? <laughs> oh, right, because this game was made by Satan. Oops, that, 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 that. Oh, good, slopes. That's what I wanted. That's all water, isn't it? Um, yeah, and this is sloped in the worst possible way with respect to the water. I see. Well, 086262654P and Thank you, Speclad, FWM. I feel like that was definitely a mistake. I should not have done both of those. Okay, that is indeed an oxid. I see. I see your game, game. Okay, that, that, uh, put a little bit too much English on that. I mean, I don't see your game, game, just to be clear, in case you thought I actually understood how to do this. No, no, I do not. Uh, because there's not enough blocks. So there's got to be some logic I'm missing here. Because I only have those four. I mean, I guess it's not inconceivable that I don't actually need all of them. That doesn't seem like that's in this game's style, though. Well, that, that X corresponds to that X. I might want to slow down uh, my mouse speed for this one. Precision! <laughs> Everybody seems very convinced that some of them are just fake. I don't, I don't know if you're actually using evidence for that or you've just decided that, but... Uh, I mean, I wouldn't quite put that beyond this game. There is no way to distinguish the maybe oxids from the not oxids. Okay, it's one one second here. One second here. Can I do one five? Is that a thing? I forget. It'll set there, but will it actually stay set? No. Okay. We're going we're going half see half speed on this. Yeah, these are quite sensitive, so that's still more than enough for this. Uh, 932S, thanks for making me enter that again. Oh, uh, Speclad is telling me things. K7O. Thank you. That's X, and I've already forgotten what that one was up there. Cool. And now, because of my slow mouse speed, I don't even have enough, uh, propulsion to get over that. That's O. Ah, the other one is Abel, of Cain and Abel fame. Interesting. I mean, I'm definitely making a mistake. There's no way that the things I'm currently doing are right. That X corresponds to the X at the top right. And I think those were both O's. The Cain and Abel franchise, says Speclad. 
Aren't we all the Cain and Abel franchise? Isn't that, uh, isn't that just the human species? I mean, I'm gonna do this, and then I won't have won, and I have no idea what to do now. Like, now I'm just screwed. So what was I supposed to do? I mean, both of those matched. The question is, can you use some trickery to move the boxes so that you don't need as many boxes? But I can't figure out how. Maybe you put all the bridges in the corners, says Spec Lad. That was my first thought, but this game hasn't really required the corner move. I'm not sure if you're even supposed to be able to do the corner move. I think that, like, if you're a pixel exact, then it works. Um, but I don't think that that's an intentional behavior. You can't hit them again once they're in the water. I mean, you can go flying over the water to hit the ones that are there. So, theoretically, like, I, I should be able to, yeah, I can hit that, but then I die. Can I make that work somehow with these? Okay, okay, video games. Okay, video games. I see your game, game. It's nothing about cornering it. There's no corners. You have seen the way you're supposed to do this. It is Satan's work. That's the way you're supposed to do this. You're just supposed to hop like a loon. I don't think this can be done with the lives I've got left. Uh, theoretically, this is possible, but it's not going to happen. Yeah. <laughs> I need to learn to do that trick without sinking. Maybe you need to build a bridge off screen and there's a bonanza of blocks over there, says Becklad. No, I have figured out the trick. We know what the trick is. Yeah, all four of these just go that way. These are the easy parts, actually. Oh, wait, no, that's not easy. Because now... Hmm. Yeah, it's not easy to get these two to go that way. Tell you what, I'm going to change my strategy here. Hello, Melanie. Am I correct that this is just jumps? I'm playing stunts now. Because, like, you can jump that gap over there if you're psychotic. I think I'm playing stunts now. That's a minus. That's a square. That's an X. Let's get... I don't know, given all the parkour in this level, if I'm going to uh, beat this level. In, in this tiny amount of time I've given to this pseudo-stream. Oh, that's, that's also minus, okay. So let's get the other minus here. <sighs> Can I learn to do this jump reliably? I think the answer is an emphatic no. It's that second part. Like, you gotta, you gotta make the jump, but then not sink. And I don't know how to do that. Okay, I don't think I've seen O, which means the other one is probably O, or one of the just, like, other jumps that I have set up so that I can't do. I don't think there's any safe way to do these, these other two jumps, the, the north and south jumps, so that, that was just a mistake. Okay, there's a way to safely do those jumps, huh? Are those jumps easier? I think those jumps might be easier, actually. I want to remember what these two are. That's square, that's x, fine. So theoretically, I can make this jump if I am just incredible. Gah! <clears throat> that jump is easier. That jump is easier, even though it's still impossible. I don't know what to do with that, though, because in this starting position, it's it would be really tricky, not impossible, to get it all aligned the other way. You know what? Let's, let's at least give that a shot. <laughs> Great. Perfect shot. I did it. Get up there. Get up there. Get up there. Get up there more. Ugh. Yeah, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Thank you, Speckled. Uh... 
trying to think if there's any other sort of trick that I'm missing here. Not that I can see. I mean, I think that actually that edge, that was brilliant. I think that actually that edge, the very, very edge is flat. So you could be like right on the beach and not fall off. What makes the jumps hard, says Spec Lad? Uh, the fact that there's no jumping. <laughs> you, you, it's like totally uncontrolled. Uh, so you're either gonna recoil way too far back or, uh, uh, not, not get enough, uh, oomph on it. Okay, I'm, I'm once again, I'm gonna start with this style. I'm gonna assume that that wasn't a complete mistake. So I have two of these, and two of those. Oh my god, in trying to like, rearrange myself. It's very nice of you to do this, uh, spec lad, but given that I'm not going to succeed in like, even getting to the point of being able to use that information, I don't know how helpful it is. Get that. Okay, I see, I see. I think I see the logic here. I'm going to intentionally drown myself there, because I'm obviously not going to make any progress with no, uh, lives. Hmm. Maybe I need more oomph. Let me try it with this. Well, that, that, okay, never mind. I need less oomph. I can actually stay on there if I'm careful. So those are actually both accessible now, which means technically this level is beatable, but it isn't actually. Uh, so that's minus, that's x, that's square. These ones, of course, are quite easy to get to. That's square, that's convenient, good timing. That's circle, which I haven't even found yet. These jumps, that I keep saying are easier and then screwing up. Because <laughs> you can easily bounce off and then land in the right place, but then it's difficult to sort of, uh, correct yourself once you're there. So, I think I just need to... I just need to get good scrub. That's, that's really all there is to this level. I just need to get good scrub. Okay, accidental success. Once it's all knocked down, it's not even that bad. Damn it. Uh, okay, that's O and X. Let's see what these ones are. That's O, so I can take care of that relatively safely. Like so. See what this one is. That's minus. Okay, so we've got x and minus. And then I should figure out what both of these are. There's minus. That's square. Which means one of these two, that I keep saying are easy but aren't, are uh, my ticket out of here. See, they're easy. I didn't hate that level anywhere near as much as it probably sounded like I hated that level. <laughs> Once I figured it out, it was like, okay, okay, Oxid, I see your game, fine. Oh. Oh, and there's gravity too, that's what I wanted. 76 rooms still to go! No, there's not! <laughs> no, there's not, you lying punk! <laughs> Well, it says rooms, not, uh, landscapes. Why would I go over there? What kind of psychotic behavior was it to go over there? That's nonsense. Okay, that's nothing. 76 rooms before the end of the tutorial, says, uh, speculated chat. Close to meditation, says Joshua. It says there are 100 levels, so meditation is the end of the game. Okay, that was possibly unwise, but we're just gonna run with it. Huh. This is the first one that hasn't just opened on command. But I can get through it even without it opening. Okay, definitely didn't want to hit that, but it's no big deal, hopefully. That one opens on command. 
Thus far, there's no level in this level. That one opens on command. Maybe there are just 76 uninteresting rooms to go through. Maybe that's this level. Just go through 76 uninteresting rooms and wonder why they made this level. <sighs> I think you will hate this level, says Melody. I mean, you could just say that 50% uh, of the time and I would, you know, you would, you would be right more often than not. Uh, that that was that was uh, really badly phrased. You could say that a hundred percent of the time, and you would be right more often than not. There we go. Okay, some um, umbrellas and a uh, uh, smashy smashy that does not smash those blocks. Cool. But that looks like space. Oh, but I have umbrellas. Okay, I don't really have anything to deal with that, uh, bomb with. Uh... <laughs> Like, I could use those bombs, but they're, they're in the wrong place. This, this won't do anything, as I recall. Oh! Well, I'm completely wrong. Thank you. Thank you, Spec. Glad you saved me. I mean, this is not the right strategy at all. I'm definitely not actually making progress here. Cool. Okay, that's just timing. That's no big deal. Is it just, like, 76 very slight challenge rooms? Is that all this is? <laughs> I guess I should read that note, but I'm gonna get the, uh, the magic glasses first. Sorry, there are only 19 rooms. So it's, it's room count earlier was, uh, deception. Uh, don't hit that block. Don't hit the block. Okay. I shouldn't have hit that block either, but whatever, it's fine. Oy vey! Wait, but that's all just water, so that's nothing. Weren't there some bombs around too, Aspect Lab? That, not the kind you can pick up. Picking up bombas is weird. <sighs> okay, this is one of those, the puzzle is figuring out what the puzzle is levels. I love those. I love those levels. The puzzle is figuring out what the puzzle is. There's a disc slot at the top right. I don't like that that's there. Ha! <laughs> they instantly sink. That's actually quite funny. Oh, I'm not in gravity anymore. Ah, uh, get down there, please! Oh. I don't have a disc for the disc slot, and the disc slot is mandatory, and it's an important disc slot, and it opens the thing. 